This is Bunny Drumming on behalf of buymeaniphone.com. Check out the link in the sidebar. I've got it on though. I need to take off my decal gel, which I've had on now for probably a couple of months, and it's held up really well. It did get some scratches. I don't know whether you can see really. Probably not. But the scratches that appeared sort of arrived in the first couple of days I had it on. And never seemed to get much worse after that. And just because it's a black design, I suppose, you really can't see them. I've had lots of comments about this. This is the whimsical design. In fact, when I went into the Apple store recently, one of the geniuses, genii? an apple genius um, absolutely loved it so I ended up giving her the address where she could get them from and I've had lots of comments about it so it should be quite easy to take off she says here we go I'm not sure whether you they say you can keep the decal girls I know they said that about the jelly skins that you can reapply them and actually I have got my last de um, jelly skin and I'm just going to quickly put it on before I put the eye styles one on to see whether you can reuse them and how successful it is. I'm not going to keep this one even though I've absolutely loved it. I won this in um, the It's Me Morpheus big draw. He sent me this and a few others so thank you Carlos. I've loved it thought of you every time I've looked at it of course so we'll just stick that over there and we'll just give a quick clean um, the one thing about the decal girl that's different from the jelly skin is it doesn't protect around the top and the bottom the um, skin literally just goes on the back whereas with the um, Jealous skin, it does go around, wrap around the sides and almost reaches to the chrome. Well, it does reach to the chrome. So I have noticed I've picked up the odd little um, scratch on a corner. But to be honest, I think I'm at that stage now where I've had it long enough that I don't cry over every little scratch. Um, so yeah, that decal girl has protected it really well. So as I said, I'm just going to quickly throw on my old jelly skin, which was this one. I, I mean, it doesn't stick to this at all. I've had it pressed between some heavy books for a while. Now you know how bad I am, but I'm not going to line it up too much because I just want to see how it sticks so that you guys can see how well it sticks on. So we'll just do a rough, very rough, lining up. Actually, it's sticking really well. I mean, I ha look, I've put it on more rubbish than I usually do. But, do you know what? That has stuck much better than I expected it to. You have to sort of push your nail underneath to get it to come up. I thought because it hadn't flattened out really much between the books that it wouldn't do much of a good job. But I'm really impressed. So that's the Jelly Skins girls, the second time... Girls and boys, sorry. The second time I've put it on, and I haven't even put it on very well, I've just thrown it on, and that's stuck really well. So... I'll take this off a bit more carefully. If anyone out there is wondering whether you can use them again, the answer seems to be that yes, they do work quite well. So I'll stick that back on there. We'll put it back in its case and stick it between some books for a little while longer. Um... Okay, so from the video you can see that the jelly skin works really well when you're reusing it. And this was just a short review on behalf of buymeaniphone.com. So this is Bunny Drumming saying goodbye. Bye!